the schmuck. Oh, the story still continues. He speaks and reads. He's amazing. <laughs> oh God, it just never gets any better. The bow to the bear. Dude. I wonder how many times he's blown himself up over the course of these 30 years. I'd be willing to bet he doesn't take any notes, so he doesn't know what he's doing. Hmm. Ooh. You're a shit, mister. Ooh. He ain't having it. Mm-mm. Hmm. Yeah, have him bite you across. <laughs> what is tight around his neck? Can tell you. His voice is so adorable. <laughs> They really busted his ass for that mushroom. Yeah, he did. <laughs> I can't breathe. <laughs> okay, slime ball's back. Yeah. Saw him and he let him rock. I mean, that's what we would expect of Dalton, though. <clears throat> yeah. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> oh boy. It's going to explode. No, it's going to be cherry blossoms. Now what you gonna do with it? Yeah. I mean, that's a good start. I feel like that's the right thing to do after 30 years of research. Just pop off a little bit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
That would be a big celebration. Have a little beer, do a little dance. Mm-hmm. Hmm. The hell? Yeah. It's kind of a cute little place. Yeah. Her little tree, her little tree house. Yeah. Kind of like the Shire. Yeah. <laughs> Sickness of the heart. I didn't realize he ever said that. Otherwise, I wouldn't have. But I feel like we had it. Mm -hmm. Why is she so ticked off? I don't understand. Hmm. <laughs> Damn. She's pretty cold. Hmm. Maybe that's why she won't put up with it. She's known you for a long time. Straight to the point, though. So, <laughs> like, hey, we don't have time for this. Chill out. Uh oh. Uh oh, what? Yeah, I'm thinking she looks horrified. And I just wonder why she looks horrified about it. Damn, woman. He's already bandaged up. Fuck. Oh. Mm. Well, Nice music. Hmm. 
<laughs> he cares so much. Mm -hmm. He is a man of depth and feeling. Mm. Wow. That's Did tough. Blow himself up? I think so. Yeah. They yeah, I wondered if they, if they shot him. I don't think so. Oh, That's poor tough. little guy. Man, he has been through it. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Your worst nightmare, yeah. that's what it is. I fuck with Dalton, man. That's my guy. He is. He's a good dude. Yep. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> He's got perseverance, that little guy. It's a hell of an internship. Yeah. Oh, God. Right on time. Shithead numero uno. <laughs> hey, dude, we've gotten rid of worse than you. Oh, man. Well, how do you feel about that episode? That was pretty good, that, yeah. I mean... You know, like was it hit was it hitting you in the feelings? Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. I felt so bad for that little guy. And I, I felt bad for the you know, oh, for the doctor too. Yeah. For the, that quote, when does a man die? He dies when he's forgotten. Mm -hmm. That's a, it's a big one. I mean felt obviously feel for Dalton as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I remember my first time through uh that moment with Chopper waving the flag and all that smoked me. Like, did a number on me bad. Like, all the other stuff, yeah, I felt it, but when he's just there, you know, he's saying, you know, there might not be a cure to everything, but I'll become that. I was mm -hmm. like, it, and it's, it stuck with me, too. Like, I'm talking, like, probably my first watch through One Piece, was, it was around, I think, 9.20 is around what episode it was on. Mm. 9.15, 9.20. Wow. When I, by the time I caught up, that was the single, like, biggest thing that stuck with me was, was that. Burned in your brain. Oh, yeah. Etched. Yeah. Because it was, you know, that in, in its truest form, that's a mission statement. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it is. True. Very true. This one, I think, is just as dramatic as uh, the episode where... Bellamere? Yes. Thank you. Or Bellamere shot yeah. and and they you know we, we got the whole story on why Nami was the way she was and yeah. what she'd been doing the whole time yeah. oh the, yeah the unfolding of Sanji's backstory as well oh yeah 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 man when he when he wants to get emotional 
and dramatic. Yeah. He really pulls out all the stops. Yeah, he definitely probably One Piece's shining metal as a as an anime and manga goes is uh, the backstories. Mm -hmm. Like nobody can really ever argue uh, with you know the the emotional value he'll pull out of backstories. Now some people might say I wish he did it a little more in the present tense, but mm -hmm. yeah, no, the backstories are ten out of ten phenomenal. Yeah. I agree, and this—I think it—it it definitely puts Doctor. What's her name? I'm terrible with names. Yeah, Korea in a in a whole new light. Because yeah, she is cold, but I think interpreting that way is a little misrepresented. Yeah, I think she she doesn't have patience for BS. She's also seen 139 years of this world. God, and I can't even imagine. Has seen. What, the entirety of the Drum Kingdom since Wapple took over? Yep. Has seen probably multiple rules prior, you know? Has mm -hmm. seen a lot of people come and go. Generate, like, four generations. Yeah, yeah. Five. But, yeah, she's yeah. seen a lot. Yeah, she has. I'm sure she's been through a lot since, yeah. you know, all the doctors went away. Even before they did. Because they had a, mm -hmm. they, who knows how long they've been gone. That's less than a quarter of her life, though. Yeah. You know, I could imagine that a lot of why she's, you know, people consider her greedy and why she just takes things from people. Like, she's probably just seen in the long run. It's not even worth to just be benevolent yeah. or just be that charitable. It's like, what, what does it do, you know? Yeah, and I wonder if she actually collects on all of them. Mm -hmm. She may not. I mean, she could not. The last thing you want to be do is be perceived as a charitable person that people can be taken advantage of, though. Yeah, true. Woo! I feel like I've been through the ringer. I think I have. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was the ringer. Yeah. It was good. It was a, a wonderful episode. I mean, what, three episodes? Four? Yeah. With this whole... Art. It's pretty incredible. It's a good string. Yeah, and it was really nice music underneath it. Mm -hmm. Really nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like when you you know it's about to pop off when they bring in like the choir scores. Oh yeah. Oh, oh they're yeah. About to reach in the bag a little bit. Yeah, Ave Maria. I went, oh shit. <laughs> 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 oh yeah, it's going down. It was like, oh, he's going to the castle, and here come here come the Gregorian choirs. Like, yeah. uh oh, <laughs> oh, he is going to the castle. He's not leaving. Yes, this is a come to Jesus moment. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's what we used to call it when we got called into the boss's office. Oh, it's <laughs> a come to Jesus moment. <laughs> that was wonderful. question well it would it would appear as though wapo has arrived on the scene most of our players are in the vicinity yeah unfortunately we have to deal with mouth but yeah but i'm still thinking that don't like him back he's gonna thaw out and come kick his ass yes. that would be the the best outcome possible yes it would nothing better to see than dalton get his comeuppance oh yeah because man it's it's really hard not not to feel for him too because he's just you know, he's he's sort of been the inside job man. He's been, you know, he remained in the guard because the previous king was good to him and the people, which was his father, couldn't stand the son, really probably just stayed in the guard to keep an eye on the son. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the son's enacting all kinds of hardships on the country and he's just like doing his best to mitigate and- Yeah, he's he's been you know, very responsible for the people. Yeah, not give himself up. And then, you know, even he saw Chopper and Hero Loop there, and he's like, nah, for all the bad medicine you might have, your heart is. Hero Loop had a golden heart in his eyes. Mm -hmm. And he's like, I, you know, I hate to see this more than anybody. Yep. So. What is that animal that he rides? The uh, Wapo? Yeah. It's like a hungry hippo, I think. It's like a cross between a yak and a hippo. Yeah. <laughs> Well, it's like, it's kind of like the, I, I look at it like the Hungry Hippo from like the, the little like party game, like the little kids game. Oh, yeah, hungry yeah. Hippos. Hungry, hungry, hungry yeah. Hippos. Yeah. Because it's, uh. It does look like a hippo. I mean, Oda, the author likes to reach into his 
you know, both obviously his his folklore or a common story bag because like all right we have a, a blue-nosed reindeer mm. right we have we have we have a rudolph element going on here yeah but then but then also like there's probably some other element he's pulling from with the yeti story it could be as simple as bigfoot or something like that so it wouldn't surprise me if he was also if he also just reached for like a hungry hippo or something yeah yeah the um uh the rabbits i was wondering if they are a tribute to Monty Python. Yeah, you said that before. Yeah. So it could be, it could be some that could be there too. That wouldn't surprise me at all either, because he de- he definitely likes to, you know, dip into his cultural references, as you've also mm-hmm. seen with obviously, you know, Mister Five and Twiggy. Yeah. Miss Valentine, mm-hmm. Twiggy though. Um, and you know, you'll see you'll see more of that. Like there's certain characters that, uh. He's he's used as homage to like Japanese like actors from like classic films and mm-hmm. things like that, mm-hmm. among other things. And in some of his art, I think it was when they uh, were giving a little bit of backstory for uh, Bragi and Dorian Bragi. Yeah, and uh, some of the art that he used there it wasn't black and white but it was close and it looked very much like um oh i think 16th or 17th century japanese uh characters it looked very much like that stuff could be the case too like i said he really likes to reach into his his reference bag he, he likes to reference things very transparently yeah he's he's obviously very well read and culturally very cultural sponge yeah good sort good term mm-hmm. yeah good episode yeah it's very nice. good well this is i think we are probably going to be done here yeah okay people one more maybe 87 cool